so many years ago, house cleaning was a time-consuming, back-breaking job for the housewife, one she disliked heartily. If she had one of the early cleaners, she was considered lucky. Cleaning was a snap. Up the back. <laughs> and she still had to assemble buckets, ladders, mops, and sweepers to really do the job. But today, the modern vacuum cleaner has taken all that drudgery out of cleaning. And it's ready to go to work for you at a moment's notice. See how easily it goes over the door sill, out onto the floor, up onto the rug, without once catching or tipping. It swivels easily, too, all because of the big rubber-tired wheel. There's no lifting, dragging, or carrying. The light wands easily lock in place. And there's even a specially designed grip to keep the arm and wrist from getting tired. And yet, with all of these advantages, many women still don't get the most out of their vacuum cleaner. A lot of research has been done by manufacturers to find the best method of cleaning. Questionnaires and time and motion studies have shown that if you follow certain general rules, you'll do your cleaning easier and faster. Above the floor cleaning should be done first. The draperies are a good place to start. You begin by setting the power dial, which has settings for floors, rugs and general cleaning, cotton carpeting, or in this case, where you cut down the suction for draperies. All the cleaning tools you need for each cleaning job ride right along with the cleaner in the compact built-in tool rack. For draperies and upholstery, use the upholstery tool. The floating brush loosens any clinging dirt. Using one or both wands gives you the reach you need to clean all the way to the top. With the upholstery nozzle flat against the drapery, suction brush all the dust that makes the colors appear dull and faded. And be sure your strokes overlap each other so the drapery is thoroughly cleaned. When that's done, the upholstered furniture is easily cleaned with the same tool. When you suction clean upholstered furniture this way, you actually get all the dust off the fabric before it gets a chance to work in and dull the colors. They'll stay brighter much longer. With the surface cleaned, the crevice tool will reach a lot of hard to get at places. For example, between the cushions and sides of upholstered furniture. <laughs> See how it pays to use the crevice tool? Now here's the new and quick way to do all your dusting. Suction dusting with a thickly bristled brush allows you to reach a lot of home furnishings that you couldn't do with an old-fashioned dust scattering cloth. It's wonderful for lampshades, both outside and inside. <laughs> 